and welcome to our first orchestra concert of the year. My name is Kata Marshall and I play the viola in the seventh grade intermediate orchestra. In, the first piece we will play for you tonight is called Into the Sky. In class we learned about dynamics. These are markings in the music that, the, that indicate we, whether we are supposed to play loudly or softly. Listen and see if you can hear our dynamics. Enjoy.
name is Daisy Peters, and I play the violin in the 7th grade intermediate orchestra. The next piece we'll play for you is called Can Can. This is the French composer Offenbach's most famous tune. Our violin section had to work very hard to get all the high notes in this piece. Watch for the part where our bows bounce off the strings. This is called Spiccato. We hope you enjoy this familiar tune. While the eighth graders are coming on stage to join us, um, I just want to say welcome. Thank you guys for coming. It's been an absolute joy to have the seventh graders this year. Um, they came to me, and you know they're young and they've only played for a little while, and um, they hadn't played many pieces where they're doing all different parts. So this is new for them. They're all in sections. We have our first violins. First violins, raise your hand. Okay. We have our second violins playing a whole different part over here. Violas cellos, and our bass. So there's five different parts that they have to put together. So they have really had to go home and practice. And I know I'm so proud of them. I wish that I would have recorded them on the first day of class and recorded them tonight. Because the first day of class was a little interesting. Okay? I questioned myself if I picked appropriate music, but they did, they did a fine job. I know many of your children went home and they practiced. Yes, okay. Some of these students here, I was getting on my high schoolers, they were going and they're going, Mrs. Payne, I practiced two hours yesterday. This girl over here told me she was practicing like two hours, three hours. I put on a performance for my parents. So again, they can't do this without your support. So thank you so much for encouraging them to practice and encouraging them to perform for you at home as well as here. They've done a fabulous job. They have improved so much since the beginning of the school year. So I'm very proud of them and they know that and I tell them. So I just want, just want to make a point of that. They have done excellent. Thank you for letting me teach them. and I play the cello in the 7th grade intermediate orchestra. The final piece we will be playing for you tonight is called Fiddles on Fire. This piece highlights all sections of the orchestra and demonstrates... Whoops. <laughs> 
and is also a very fun piece to play and to listen to. This is also our favorite piece, and we hope you enjoy it as much as we do. play for you is a show them farewell. This piece is from the famous PBS series The Civil War. This piece features our very own violin soloist Andy Larson. 
Also, we worked on our ship day in this piece. We hope you enjoy.
Hello, my name is Dustin Tack from the 8th grade concert orchestra and the final piece we will be playing for you is Dance of the Hari Quinn. We had a tough time playing together and every instrument had a really challenging part, but we hope you enjoy. <laughs>
I'm also really proud of our eighth graders. As you can tell, we have a kind of small class, okay? So um, it, it's, it's nerve-wracking for them, I know it is, okay, to be up there, and they have to be really responsible for their individual parts, and I challenge them this year. So um, they've also rose up to the occasion. I'm really proud of them. You guys can go to your seats, by the way. <laughs> okay, um, give us a couple moments if you want to put the house lights on. We're going to move some chairs and do a set change. We have a brand new thing this year called our Fiddle Club. They memorize their music and they come on Thursdays and practice once a week, an hour after school. So just give us here a couple minutes to clear off some of the stage and then we will resume with the Fiddle Club. Thank you.
play the violin, and the next song that we're going to play for you is a song by Brian West. It is a Latin American song, and it is called Rumba. Chase Brown and I am a violin player in the symphonic orchestra. The next song we will be playing for you is called Ferrandol by uh, George Bizet. Can't pronounce that, there's a reason why I'm in Spanish. But anyway, uh, <laughs> anyway, we worked very hard on this and uh, our shifting, it did take a while to learn, but hey, I, I think the piece is great and I think that you will enjoy it too. Enjoy.
my name is Michaela Epps and I play the violin in Chamber Orchestra. Um, this first piece that we will be playing for you is called Hopak from the Ferris Sorenshinks. The Ferris Sorenshinks is an unfinished opera by Modest Mussorgsky, who is more famously known for his song Night on Bold Mountain, which we played last year, if you were fit. And so this, um, the Hopak is actually a Ukrainian dance that um, is accompanied by lively, upbeat music, and it is mainly performed by men, and many stunts are performed. In this piece, the first and second violins will be switching off the melody, and listen for those parts. We hope you enjoy. which is a wedding, and it was finished in 1942, and its tune is used throughout genres of music today. Uh, while you're listening to it, please listen for the alternating beats between the violins and cellos, and the beautiful viola part. Also, pay close attention to our wonderful violin solo played by C.C. Parker Berg, as mentioned in your program, and I hope you enjoy this song. Thank you. 
and the other different things that we're going to be able to do with that money. So thank you again to those parent volunteers, and thank you to all parents for, again, letting me work with your wonderful children. I hope you have a wonderful night and enjoy the last two pieces. The next piece we will be performing for you is called Dreamer's Farewell by Robert Kerr. This song was written after the stylings of Stephen Foster, who is known for as the father of American music and is known for his songs, Oh Susanna, Camp Town Races, and Beautiful Dreamer. Uh, Dreamer's Farewell has many beautiful melodies changing between sections, and we hope you love it as much as we have.
Hi, my name is Monica Smith and I play the violin. The next piece we'll be playing here tonight is called Fantasia for Strings. This piece was composed especially for a string orchestra due to its changing dynamics and tempos. As we play, listen to the interchanging melodies that changes between sections. We hope you enjoy. <laughs> 